support preferences notification okay so I've done the first few right um, up to there and now this is the rest of support preferences and these bunch are now about notification okay so let's go and look at notification so they split up between these different sections right so we're gonna look at notify filer on support rep cases right notify filer check this box to automatically send email notification to customers when cases are created by support reps this preference applies only to cases submitted by support reps using the case record in your NetSuite account. Email notification is sent using the template you select in the new case customer notification template. Right, so yes, I want that notify filer on external cases. Right, so that's this one here. Check this box to automatically send email notification to customers when cases are submitted using the external case form in the customer center. This does not send not notification to customers submit, submitting cases using online case forms. To send notification to these customers, you must select an email template in the send auto reply email field or, um, on the setup workflow sub tab of the online item record. Email notification is sent using the template you select in new case customer notification template. All right, and then we have notify main support email on external cases. All right, check this box to send notification email to the support email address entered on the general sub tab when new cases are created with an external case from the customer center. All right, so that's those three creation inbound email capture so once that case has been created there can now be emails attached to the case right notify customers check this box to automatically send email notification to customers when cases are submitted by email using the email capture feature and we will get in a one of the next videos to that um, very handy feature email notification is sent using the template you select in the new customer new case customer notification template right notify to list here it is check this box to send notification that a case was created to each email address listed in the to line of the original email right this preference works like a reply to all from the to line right notify CC list check this box to include addresses in the CC line of the original email when replying to incoming cases uh, with notification. Right, then we've got assignment of cases. Right, so we've got notify and assignees. Check this box if you want support reps to automatically receive notification email when support cases that they are assigned to are updated. So yeah, I think you absolutely want that one ticked send notification replies to customer check this box to allow support reps to respond to the customer after receiving notification that they've been assigned to the case right i have this one not ticked so i will go ahead and tick that one all right then we've got under update okay so this was assigning a case this is updating a case right so um, check this box if you want support reps to automatically receive notification emails right and send check this box to allow support reps to to respond to customer to the customer after receiving notification that they've been assigned to the case actually I think I have a mistake here so I'm just gonna quickly check okay I actually did have a couple of these ones wrong so I've now fixed them. It's essentially these two and these two go together. This is about assignment of a case and this is about update of a case. Similar thing with escalation, right? So you've got assignment, update and escalation and 
in your options here you can choose for each of those ones and they essentially work the same whether you want to send um, have the support rep able to send the customer right so now our next one here is around inbound email and I will do that on my next um, video